I don't love Scorpid, but I think it's fine. Coin cookie into Scorp. Well, Scorpid might be pretty insane here. Uh, probably... Hmm. I think Bolt and Portal both potentially make a lot of sense. I have a lot of stuff to play, though, so I guess I'll go Bolt over Portal, just since it's cheaper. Uh, Cookie next turn, and then Dungeoneer Bolt the following turn, maybe. Ouch. Well, I've got a lot of healing coming, so it doesn't matter too much that I'm already almost dead. Easy heals. Canal Slogger is decent, but not really necessary. I'll just kill that thing with a bolt. Didn't even need to bolt it, honestly, since I picked up Storm, but whatever. My gut reaction was three minions play Lightning Storm, but only one of those is a real minion. Do I just run a slogger into it? Maybe that's fine. Is this a four drop? I guess I can devolve it. Let's see what this can do for me. Overdraft. Uh, I think I just trade overdraft at this point. Draw with investment opportunity. And then, sure, we'll go devolving missiles. What an insane one drop. Maybe this is finally the lightning storm. Multicaster. I've played Arcane. Maybe only an arcane spell? Could just go storm flame here. Be overloaded for three. Being overloaded for three is okay. Hit with the weapon here just because I'm getting a little bit low. I can slog missiles. Seems like the play. Three, two. 
Uh, I need three more spells for Yogg. Should be easy enough with uh, Investment Opportunity and Multicaster. I believe Multicaster draws three now. Um, the storm probably isn't good enough to stop the multicaster here. Hopefully I can draw, uh, the overdraft works actually. Does it work? It only deals two damage, huh? It doesn't quite work. Can trade for perfect, uh, perpetual flame. Yeah, I mean, casting it doesn't really do that much for me. Found a nice flame. So my Yogg is ready. I'm overloaded next turn, but uh, it'll be ready after that. If this Talon can find my Macaw, which it does 25% of the time, then over two turns I can go Yogg into Bolner uh, double Macaw. Time for the Yogg Saran onslaught. Oh, a good old fashioned Yogg Saran. Apparently, I got a lightning bloom since these are playable. Excellent target for the doggy biscuit. Lots of really good targets from this Yogg Saron. I am running out of cards. My hand is full. Break it, you Break it, you At least I've seen one rock biter double storm strike, so I shouldn't be able to die here. Alright, time for some more Yogs. Hopefully these Yogs don't also draw four cards, or however many the last one drew. 
And hopefully Bolner survives the first Yogg. Very exciting. Oh, card draw. Nice. Oh, more card draw. Nice. Okay, 7-7 seven, seven is actually nice. And the Grand Slam is actually nice. Garot is nice. Oh, a good old roasting. Uh, this is just a coin flip since we both take two pyroblasts. Okay. Easy. The third Yogg Saron always gets them. Love to see card draw. Maybe I can eat Rikara with Mutanus, but I'm not counting on it. They didn't kill my 1-1, one, one, so Serpent Shrine Portal is a kill here. I'm not sure if I love Wormall Challenger. Definitely better than some random 3-3, three, three, though. This damage is pretty good. Means my pair of minions can kill this next turn, or it puts it into perpetual flame range. Probably just going to play Flame here. How do you go face with the weapon there? I've played a Serpent Shrine Portal and a Perpetual Flame. This Multicaster does draw two. Hopefully I can play Devolving Missiles first and make it draw three. Looks like this is a pretty good Devolving Missiles target as well. Let's just go with a nice old board clear. It does overload me for two next turn, so I probably won't be able to Mutanus the Rokara. But, I don't know.
They could have just played Rokara here, right? Seems pretty foolish of them. Well, I can't even play Yogg next turn anyway, so not much reason to play Talon, I think. Drew Yogg anyway. I don't think I need to use the weapon yet. Alright, I'm gonna need Instructor Fireheart to save me, I guess. Really weak, expensive selection of cards here. I guess Molten Blast. Still need to cast three spells for Yogg. I do have three in hand, but overload is a problem. Oh, hey, they got a Gore Howl. That's nice. After a friendly Murloc dies at a random legendary. Well, I've already played Cookie, unfortunately. Uh, I think I can actually get some use out of Bulner, so I'll hold on to it. Should have rolled the totem before deciding how I traded. Until I can find Armor Vendor or Canal Slogger. I probably am just going to be dead to Mr. Smite every turn, which is annoying. I guess I have Talon to block a hit, actually. I'll just go for this. That's the tenth spell for my Yogg. Maybe Bulner can block a cannon shot. Maybe it blocks a weapon hit too. In the box? All right, no smite. And they did leave my Bulner up for the Yogg. Oh, Canal Slogger. No, there's no way Canal Slogger is good enough. Oh, it's the... Bolner that uses the Yogg's battle cry. Easy win for me. Imagine leaving a 1-2 in play. <laughs> 